Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So we have shifted planets. Let's have a quick look at the star map. Not that it really makes that much difference, but uh, we have moved up here. Uh, where are we? Up here. Um, at Tokdo, and we're going to have a look here. We don't have a lot of contracts we can pull off here, um, but we do have a few. And I want to jump right into a few of them. We've got Hide the Evidence, which I think is more than... Uh, easy enough for us to do is to destroy a base mission against Comstar. And we've got a front lines one here against uh, an elite lance of the pirates. Sending a message, which I don't, I don't think we'll do, but we might do leave a mark. I want to try and get all three of these done today. So we're going to start off with hide the evidence because I think, I think this one will be the most difficult one. Um, but let's have a look at our lances here. Um, if you go to the mech bays real quick. Most of our mechs are back and up and running here. Uh, we've still got some of the heavier guys uh, being refit here. The Catapult 2C has finally been refit. Um, the uh, other Catapult has been pulled out of service. This one has been refit and is getting working. I sold a whole bunch of mech parts. All the like uh, um, medium and light mech parts that, you know, for mechs that we're never going to either encounter again or ever want to have constructed I just sold them all off uh, normally I don't like I said normally I don't norm, normally I don't sell mech parts uh, I hang on to them um, just because you know whatever mech we complete we'll use but in this case we're not going to be using any of them so I just sold a bunch of them off we do have enough to make our uh, financial report we got all these guys fixed up we got the timber wolf here um, the black cat that is uh, up and running um, let's have a look at this guy real quick it's almost back to what its original self was. Uh, it's pretty close, but not exact. So we got prototype double heat sinks. The heat efficiency right now is uh, 105 and 186. That's because we have two ER smalls, which we're not going to be using all the time. These guys put off uh, 13 each. So with these two turned off, and the ER PPCs and the ER larges both firing, we are well under heat uh, specifications for this thing. We have heat dissipating armor, endosteel, uh, client exchanger and stuff. So. Didn't really have a lot to put in here, but we put the fire control system energy in for accuracy as well as uh, enhanced imaging and sensors tracker and the weapon mounts on this thing. So these um, PPCs and large lasers should be extremely active and it's relatively fast. We have a 300 core in here plus a supercharger. So this thing can move really quickly um, if we needed to and it can be a nice backstabber or whatever. So I think once we were, when we're, when we're running heavy mechs, this will be the um, mech that we give back to Mockingbird. This was the one that she had before too. Uh, so yeah, that's probably what we'll do. Um, yeah, so, and I don't think we really changed anything else. I was going to do a new refit on the Screamer. Um, there was a good suggestion on it, and that was dropping uh, a pair of um, uh, heavy-medium lasers and an ATM in this thing. I think we'll leave it this way for now, um, just because it's going to require me to get a few things that I don't have right now. What I'd like to do is um, get a prototype double heatsink kit and put some prototype double heatsinks in here. Um, we've got an, currently a clan exchanger in here, but I want like more heat reduction if I'm going to go that route. These things here have heat of 40. Well, maybe we can... Actually, you know what? Maybe we can do it. Um, medium improved heavy lasers. They have heat of 35, so that's actually not too bad. But then once the ATM goes in, our heat's going to go way up. And right now, our heat efficiency isn't the best. 66, 80, uh, 68. Uh, as soon as we jump, that drops drastically. So, yeah. Um, let me think about it. Because if we drop two of these guys in, right? If we drop two of these in, that's six tons left over. And we could put an ATM-6 in. Um... Where is it here? ATM-6 is what? Three and a half tons? Three and a half. We'd have enough for a ton of ammo. Which I think would probably be more than enough. And if we're going to go close, then we'll be putting HE ammo in. Which I'm not sure we actually have at the moment. Don't actually have any. We're going to have to pick up some ATM ammo before we do that build, I think. Because all we've got is the ER right now. Um... We can't even improve it, put an improved one in because, well, we have regular ammo. But I don't think we have an improved six, though. Do we? Yeah, we do have an improved six. Still the same weight. 
these are basically like streak launchers, right? So, Trago Fire Artemis Fire Control System. It's already got a breacher. Um, yeah, we could actually go ahead and do that. Oh wait, that's a regular ATM, and we don't have a a uh, improved ATM six. So we're gonna need to get some ammo. So let's actually just check the store really quick. I don't think I checked it when I got here. Probably should have. Most likely I checked it for a weapon weapons mount, didn't see one, and then gave up on it. They do have a supercharger here, though. Uh, I'm going to actually purchase this half load of AMS ammo before I forget. LRM, ammo, SRM. Nope, no ATM ammo. Okay, well, we'll keep our eyes open for that today. And if we can get some, I'd like to, you know, ultimately get some HE ammo in there. Because those two improved... Like, these things are doing 60 each at a nice range, right? And if we can get... Um, if we can get... Um, the medium uh, improved heavy lasers in there in the arms. I know they're volatile, but they do 50 damage each plus the ATMs. It'll way outweigh what we've got now. And the screamer can backstab. I mean, it can get in close and backstab. I like the accuracy of the large lasers and the ability to stay at range, but I mean, we are, you know, using a unit here that's mostly relatively mid range units, so we can get into mid close range with the screamer. All right, let's get into some contracts right away here. Well, not right away, but right now. And we're going to take hide the evidence first. See if we can beat these guys down fast. It is Comstar, so I don't expect um, uh, an easy fight by any means. Okay, that's, I'm going to give that Mockingbird the Black Cat. And then maybe we put... Um, I want to give the PPCs... we got light tag damage on this mech. Um, or we want to go with the Orion... Let's go with the Orion. Let's pummel the stink out of these guys. Let's just do this. Okay, here we go. Entering a restricted area. We're always entering restricted areas. Okay, this map. Lovely. Destroy the base. Destroy the garrison. Most likely destroy the reinforcements. Okay, so I'm not sure if you guys are following um, the Night Witches series, but I mentioned there yesterday um, that um, I've seen a little bit of an advanced um, video on some of the things they're working for, working on in um, the new version of Rogue Tech. Uh, let's leave this... How much armor does this thing have? Let's fire everything. Nice. Um, so the reason why Rogue Tech is taking a while to um, come out is because um, they are currently working on new elements for Rogue Tech. So it's not only going to be the same game, they have a whole bunch of new things that they're adding to it, which is why it's taking a while. And one of the things they're adding to the game, and I'm not going to ruin it for you, um, is if you go to my uh, YouTube channel... And scroll down and find a playlist called YouTube Selects. Um, those are videos that I uh, I put a like on and just add to the channel. Just you know, just if you guys are interested in, in some stuff, it just kind of shows you what I'm interested in. But go down there and check it, check it out. Um, it's not a video that I posted. Lady Electa posted it just as a preview as to what some of the things they're working on. And this. When you have a look at this video, you'll understand why it's taking them so, so long, but you'll also be like, holy shit, that's cool as hell. I mean, that's what I thought when I saw it. I'm like, wow, this is amazing. I got to share this. So I, I'm just letting you know, go check it out if you can, um, if you're interested to see some of the things they're working on. Um, it's not a long video. It's like only a minute something. And it wasn't posted by Lady Electa. It was posted by somebody else. we got vehicles here. SRM Carrier, Puma. They better have reinforcements. Vulcan and a Ranger, really? Um, yeah, so go check it out. Uh, it's not like there's a spoiler or anything, but because um, it was posted as a sort of sneak peek as to what the, why it's taking so long. But it's totally got me excited for this. Like, I can't wait now. I'm just really, really interested to see um, 
all the other little things they're working on. Wow, these ER smalls can actually reach that. And we are running so cool on this planet. So that's almost as effective as the last loadout we had. The last loadout we had was um, two PPCs, two larges, two mediums. So this should be more than enough. Just gonna hammer them. See ya. So I'm kind of sad about the army now. Well, it is a Vulcan. Let's see if we can deleg him. Engaging target. Enemy structure is weakening. Wow, the structure took damage too, eh? Yeah, the double AMS on this thing is awesome. I want to get a laser AMS on there too. Just standing behind a rock, anything that shoots at it'll just get shot down. I'm glad I took I'm glad I took the LRMs off this thing. I totally am. I was worried that you know without the narc and stuff on there was going to be uh, more difficult, but adding the extra fast cam ammo in there, uh, the extra AMS makes all the difference in the world. All right, can we get a sight on another turret here without getting ourselves into trouble? Acknowledged. Acknowledged. Armored laser turret. 405, eh? We can still hit with the ERs at this range. God, you're a murderer. Okay, that's that last turret. Let's make sure we get this turret. Heavy shredder turret, 300 armor. Um, that's 400 and something damage. So it should be more than enough. 99% chance to hit. Yep. That turret is gone. Yeah, like I said, I'm totally psyched about this new version. Um... Let's just swarm this thing. Uh, let's multi. We might as well. We can get a building, we might as well do it. Ah, uh, not quite enough. Good thing we tagged that building. Okay, we're gonna do a multi on this because I want to get rid of this turret. So it's gonna be a fast cam and a normal round and firing. Acknowledged. Enjoy the fast cam. Enjoy the arrow. Ooh, not enough, eh? No joy. Let's try though. Move order received. I mean, I guess we could take some armor off this Jorman gun deer, but. I don't know, I loathe to do that. After that battle we had where we, we faced 11 guys at once, I'm loathe to do that. That was a close match, I gotta say, a very close match. Although it was extremely fun to play. Like, I was, I was ready to withdraw at any moment. Like, if we had another mech go down, I'd be like, Commander. yeah, I'm ready to go. But luckily it didn't come to that. Um, let's see if we can shoot up this Vulcan's leg here. Do I really care though? It's the only thing we're... Oh wow. It's the only thing we're going to get anything from here. This guy's got no armor. Wind it up and shred him please. Let's get him off of here. Just get him out of here. Commander. Turret killer. Copy that, Commander. Target destroyed. I'm shocked this Vulcan didn't take more damage to its legs from the minefield. But whatever. Whatever. 
Puma. This guy's more of a threat, so let's multi. B is going to take the swarm and everything else to A. Sharing the love. Ah, we got his mask. Okay, I'm going to put the supercharger on for the uh, black hat next next round just to see how far we can go with it. It's a whole lot of twos. Yeah. I'd rather have Griff take the damage than the Orion. Warning. Armor low. Waiting for orders. Share some damage. Confirmed. Nice. No, you got some good connection. You don't have to move. Just stay there. Should be using you against the buildings, but no biggie. Uh huh. Warning. Armor low. Who's going first? Oh, the Vulcan goes first. Wow. Sure. I don't know. I thought we hit. I thought we hit him pretty hard, but I guess he is a medium mech, so. Yeah, I like how they did the uh, initiative system. I know I've said this before, but the lighter you are, the faster you go overall. And then the skill of the pilot applies as well, right? So it's kind of cool. So inexperienced, inexperienced light mech pilot won't go before a uh, experienced um, assault mech pilot. How did you... I guess Griff is in your way now. I guess so. He has to be. Let's dial it back. I was going to say we don't want overkill, but whatever. Overkill's fine. Alright, Griff. Uh... Your hot stuff, buddy. Um, I could move into the trees, but what's the point? The trees are going to be gone next turn anyway. All right, what do we want to go after here? Probably the Puma. I think this is probably the most dangerous guy on the board. Let's Warlord this. We're going to jump it all on the, on the Puma. Did we get him? No. Nope. All right, I'm interested to see here. Supercharger on. Sprint. Good God, look at this. That's coming down the hill too, right? Coming down the hill and around the corner. How badly damaged is this Puma? Pretty badly damaged. Let's split target, let's split fire here. You and, oh, we can't even see the other vehicles, eh? Screw it then. Just shoot this guy. Wow. Look at this. We're sinking way more. I, I don't know whether it's because we're on a jungle planet. Probably. That's ECM. Where is the... Here it is. Here. Increase units heat sinking by 10%. So we need to get on a hot planet just to see what the difference will be. He's still alive, huh? Couldn't hit the front. Just couldn't do it. Damage minimal. Uh huh. Just couldn't hit the front. Like, this guy is like <laughs> one step away from death. Make sure we get him, though. Drop a couple nuclear bombs on his ass. 
Thank you. This guy must have taken some damage too. Yeah. Doesn't got much left. A lot of SRM6s though. Well, thank God for AMS. A little over a quarter of them got hit. And went down. Nice. What's up, boss? Okay, pack of sickness. What do we got? Can we shoot this guy? Yeah, we can. I want to make sure A's gone. So we're going to go this route. There we go. Alright, not bad. Standing by. He's all yours, girl. Rolling. Next on fire. Yeah, now we're heating up. Ten four. Wow, this guy's taking a punishment. Commander. Um Let's see how many of these buildings we can get. Medium, one fifty. Uh Where's the best place to hit here? Probably like right here. I'm guessing. Locked on target. It's time to <laughs> there we go. To the Nicely done. One less structure. A whole bunch of less structures. Heading out. I don't think we're going to have reinforcements. Which is sad. I was really hoping we would have because this is a bad show up here. Scratch another target. Yeah, that sucks. Mission successful. Comstar must be r running out of reliable units to put into battle there. We're going to... Yeah, it also took a lot of damage. But I mean, I did put him right in the field of fire, so... It is what it is. Alright, what are we taking here? Wasn't a whole lot we can... <laughs> Could do here. Uh, let's take these two for C bills. Um, Twenty percent increase range with missile weapons. Minus fifty percent minimum range. Let's take that. Any ATM ammo? Nope. Narc haywire ammo. We got two of these, so we don't need it. LRM double. We're not just using regular LRM ammo, so it's kind of a waste. Take this for C bills. Two hundred fifty thousand. How much is this worth? 350. This is worth 210. 290. Vulcan's only 40 tons. This was a four and a half skull mission. We got shafted. Machine gun array is how much? 60. 240. Let's take that. Sure. Doesn't really matter. It's just easier to find this guy to sell it. Alright. Uh, Vulcan piece. Bunch of other stuff we can sell. Alright. Alright, 87,000. Yeah, not too bad. Let's get those fixing. And then uh, let's go right into the next contract. We're going to do front lines. And we're going to throw our second unit in. It's elite unit from the local pirate organization. Let's see how they we do against that. Full salvage. It's going to be a tough fight, most likely because of the amount of salvage we're getting here. Um, okay, where are you here? Hannibal the Cannibal. Uh, Cocho, Judge, Avalanche. And we're going to run our standard Lance. And the Screamer. Uh, do you have the three ATMs? You've got two. Switch these two around. I really should really rename these so I know which one's which. All right, there we go. Let's do this. Let's hope for the best. Four and a half versus four and a half. Okay, here we go. This will not be an honorable fight, and this is a bad map for us, but... That being said, let's get the hell out of the water first. What do you need? Uh, I want to sprint first. Keep our stability so we can spot the enemy. What can I do, 
We need to get the hell out of the water. Alright. What do we got? Wolf found? Okay. It is an elite. It's supposed to be an elite, guys, so. Let's see what we got here. Wolf found. Trebuchet. Cataphract. Meal near. You know, there's some days you get good guys, and then other days you just get junk. Alright, let's HE this guy up. Um, he hasn't moved, so let's warlord it. Get some more damage and some more uh, accuracy. Guy standing in the wrong spot. Well, not for us, but for them. Warlord it up. Target this guy. HE it up. And here it comes. Yes. That's going to hurt. Sure is. It's unsettled already. Orders? Uh, you know your orders. Double time. Let's go. Double time. Let's go. That voice totally does not suit her look, but that's fine. Firing. Confirmed. This guy's having a bad time. Critical hit, Commander. See ya. Thanks for showing up. Yep. Stay out of the water. Confirmed. And just fire. Let her rip. We push this guy. We could close the gap, do some significant damage, maybe burrow through in one turn. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Strix. Okay, this should be an interesting fight. We gotta burrow this guy. We gotta do it fast. Uh firing. Okay, come on guys, what are you doing? Yes, Commander. Let's push him. Push him right in the face. And I'm not gonna waste the HE at this range, let's just use normal. A couple points less, but I'm okay with that. Was that it? What was that? A couple of melee mechs back here, and a catapult. Waiting for orders. Double time. So if we can burn through this guy. Okay, he's getting close. Next turn, maybe. Yeah, his leg's pretty much down. Torso, eh. We'll be a lot closer. Shit, he hit with both. Okay, dude. Dude's got targeting. Dude's got targeting. That's tricky. That's tricky, tricky, tricky. Do we go out there back strike here? Or 
Watch the evasion on this sucker. Copy that. <laughs> Look at the... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten evasion. And still a 47% chance to hit on his back. All weapons fire. Okay. Good luck with that. PPC and a Gauss rifle and a large laser. Wow. Ultra 10. Rocket launchers. Still kicked, eh? That was a nasty hit. hit your patchwork materials, too. Um, which way do we want to go here? We still got to turn before those jerks show up. So let's get in here. That's worthy of an eight. Well, it's not. Let's use normal ammo. Firing. Another hit like that, and you're toast. Okay, gonna be a good fight. Hit the torso, eh? Can't get to that guy's side, huh? And firing. Might as well shoot the whole other side, eh? Oh, no, we got this side. Okay, almost got that leg. Strix is moving on the flank. As long as they split up, it's going to give us a better chance to, to uh, defeat these guys. So we're going to shoot and scoot. Well, I hate using the term shoot and scoot, but we're going to fire at these guys and get the hell out of here. Okay. Sealing your fate. That cataphract's got to go down. You got nothing, you hear me? Okay, where's he going? He's going nowhere. Um, no, I said, well, yeah, I said we go with the HE. Come on, get that leg. Got the arm. That hit something good. Okay, the Ultra's destroyed. Okay, he's got a handful of lasers. One rocket launcher left. Thanks for showing up, buddy.
All we need is one hit. There it is. Nicely done. Scored a critical hit. Good work. Good thing you're accurate with those lasers, man. I don't know, now I'm second guessing. I'm second guessing this, the ATMs, because we have to get closer with the ATMs and the um, and the other launchers, right? Okay. And no, let's go this route. I should switch to HE. How much do we have left HE though? 93, huh? This is another 27. No, I think we gotta save the HE for the Strix and the Valkyra. Okay, nicely done. Where's that meal near? He disappeared, he's in here. That's the Valkyra, this is the Assassin, the Catapult, okay. Alright guys, what are you doing? Ooh. It's a lot of damage. Easy on the armor, buddy. Yeah. Took a hard hit there. Okay, I think we get two more kills this turn. We're gonna be split up, but there's not much I can do about that at this moment. Okay, what else are they doing here? This Mjolnir is the wild card. I have no idea where he is right now. I think we can get some back attack on him, though. Pretty sure we can get some back attacks on him. If we pull him out in here, we got guys here and guys here. He has to turn his back or sides to at least to one side or the other. Which means we can get behind him. that way, huh? Alright, firing. Wow. Why so bad? I know he's got ECM, but he's got no evasion. There he is. God damn it. This guy's accurate. He's got to go down next. That's which the right leg? Oh my god, it's almost gone. No shooting, just running. That's not good. Twenty seven left in the CT, huh? do this 
This way, probably. Okay. Hostile removed. I'm here. Understood. Got our stability back. Just a 40% chance. We're just going to take it and fire. Okay, nice. One hit. Good to go. Wish I knew how fast this guy was. Warlord's back. Let's use it on this guy. See if we can get rid of him. Firing on his backside. There goes his whole right side. And he's killed. Okay, good. That's what I was hoping to do last turn. We need to give this Mjolnir another target. Feel good about this. Wonder if he's going to move out. You gotta get the hell out of that water. You're going 20 though. God damn. You got severe leg damage. Firing. Standing by. Well, 148 damage and 80 to my legs if we do it. Or I want to engage this catapult. This is a bad proposition. There's so many guys over here. This is a death move right there. All right, firing. Targeting nice. He's got the ELRMs. We gotta get the fuck out of this water. Okay, that was bad. Yes, I know. Gotta get the hell out of the water. Wow, two hits at that percentage? Damn, girl. OK, 
Okay, the fire is receding over here. We can move back that direction. It's going to take a lot longer than I thought it was going to take. Ah, oh, man. Got to get the hell out of the water. Can't sprint very far, but we got to take it and get out of this water. Got to make a break for it. All right, firing. Uh, let's Warlord this. Get the max chance to hit, max damage. Um, we're down to very limited ATM or HE ammo, so. Okay, nicely done. Yeah. If we can keep pulling them in one at a time, this although this guy back here is going to be a death of us if we're not careful. Now the question is, do I try to knock off this assassin? Or... Do we shoot at this guy? I think we fire on this guy. Ah, only one hit this time. Come on, at that percentage? Waiting for orders. Get the left side turned. And, yep. Okay, got his arm. Knocked down. So we should be able to kill him next turn. Yep, drew that guy's IR, which is good. Better than shooting against the ATM units here at the back. This Mjolnir's got to go, too. Okay, got our stability back. What are we looking at to hit this guy? 50% with the ATMs. 88% in this guy. What do you got left here? Not a whole lot, but enough. Um, damn it. Let's go this route. All right, finally get your ass out of that water. On my way. Okay, give me the same thing, please. ATMs and medium lasers firing. Affirmative. Critical hit, Commander. This panic level is critical. Okay, I think we should be able to sneak Ocho across there now. The Strix is the terror. It can't get. We can't let him get a shot at us. Ah, oh, crap! Faster than I thought he was going to be. Oh my God! Thank you. That could have been really bad. Yeah, you're lucky. You are lucky. Oh, Millie's only fifty-three. This guy's a... he's a melee mech. Why is he only doing 53 damage? Wow, that's fast. Okay, get across here and apply the same thing that we were doing before. Multi-target. U and U. B is taking this. And A is taking... wow. Really? 38, huh? Let's leave these off for now. Fire on A, please. Or B. Nice. Then they're down to four. I 
At least the Strix is now woefully out of position. Oh god, this guy's coming in now too. 100 and something damage. Another patchwork material gone. Yeah, we're, we're, you're out of there. Don't worry. Christ, that guy is so accurate. I can't take much more. None of us can. Hmm. I don't know. Backstripe's possibility. Or we come down here and try and take his arm off. Which I think probably is the best way to go. Let's give it a shot. Close. It might have worked if we had uh, two improved heavies and some ATMs. Armor breach. Internal damage. Mm -hmm. Standing by. Okay, there goes one of them. Scored a critical hit. Good to go. Got it. Receiving you. Going full throttle. I want this meal near. Valkyra is in a position to die. We can punch through its left side. Blown past my armor. Yeah, we've all got holes in our armor. The Strix, I'm not sure. I think it's got a lot of damage reduction on it. So I don't know. I've been saving my HE ammo for that one. Get our stability back. Okay. I'm under heavy fire here. Gonna be like that, are you? I wonder if we let Avalanche have a free reign back there now. She's got back shots. Okay. Not the best chance to hit, but he's lone now, so we gotta try and take him down. Commander? Confirmed. 
Okay. I'm being flanked. Relax. Relax, you're okay. Crap, that shot went internal. Yeah, but just relax. That guy's putting himself into a bad situation. On my way. <sighs> Not the side we want, but it's the side we have to take. Okay. See ya. Okay. Commander? How are we doing armor wise? Not bad on you. I'm here. have any cover here that's the right side and that's not a good side it's not a good side all right we're almost out of ammo here guys standing by you reserve please Who's going next? Ah, damn it. Uh huh. Standing by. On my way. That's a pretty damn good chance to hit. Warlord it up. Switching it up to HE. Firing. Nicely done. Target's taken a critical hit. Vibro sword is gone. Thank goodness. He's got a boomstick left. That's it. Melee damage is down to 50. Awaiting orders. Um. Let's make sure we get the kill. Oh, really? Hopefully we get initiative on him next turn. I think we will. He's lost an arm and everything, so... Did he lose the torso? I don't know. Can't tell. What are you doing? You're taking the long shot, are you? Okay. I'm here. Twenty-eight percent. No, we just shoot him. Fifty-four. Not bad. Attacking from position. Ah, two misses. Damn it. <sighs> yeah. Well, we got our stability back, and you got your turn to move and jump. So that should keep you nice and uh, agile. That gives you a much better chance to hit. Let's take it on this guy. Nicely done. Pen to one side. Center's almost down. Okay. Don't know if it's running an XL engine. I'm hoping it is. Oh, he's coming in for a melee attack again. 
This time he hits for 50 something. Okay. Yeah. Chainsaw. Whatever the hell that thing is supposed to be. Um. It's fire maneuver. Let's go this route. Okay, that was enough. Wow. Roger that. Systems recycling for another shot. I'm ready for orders. You can't let that leg get hit. Twenty percent, huh? <sighs> okay, he's gone through the spores, which means he's going to take more damage. God damn it. I don't know what to do here. We gotta try and get behind him. Uh-huh. I'm getting my ass kicked. Waiting for orders. On my way. Double time. Get our stability back. Phantom mech. Jump. Twenty percent, huh? Well, better than nothing. I guess. Yeah, well. He jumped too, so there's not much you can do about it. We gotta get behind these guys now. <laughs> it's gonna turn into a friggin' slugging brawl at the very end here for victory. Oh fuck. God damn Goss Rifle. <sighs> He's so accurate, that guy. Down low. Too slow. Firing. Copy that. This guy's giving it to us pretty much. What what turn does he go on? Oh, it's the Strix again. Farge. I'm losing weapon system. Yeah, Commander. How far can you get?
Come on. Okay. That problem solved. We're gonna have so much repairs. But this has been fun. Let's push him back a little bit. This guy's relatively quick, so just fire the normal normal atom. Normal ammo atom. I don't know where. Let's just go for a CT hit. We're just really trying to push him back. Good to go. Moving to position. Max out the damage as much as we can. I forgot to change all my ammo, didn't I? He's still going before us. What? <sighs> this is coming down to the last of it, guys. Not for long. He's hitting everybody hard. Can't get behind him, eh? I can't believe you still have your leg, but whatever. <sighs> Hope for the best. He's got so much damage reduction. I'm at a long range missile. Waiting for orders. Coordinates received. Okay. It's up to you, girl. Hammer him. So you don't knock us over. Only got one. God, you missed at that high percentage. <laughs> no. Oh, he's gonna go before us. Oh no, avalanche goes again. Standing by. Seventy-seven percent chance. Oh. <laughs> Negative damage. Oh. Copy that. Let's see what he does. Oh, for one LRM five with thunder ammo. Okay. We get on the other side of him. We can. Let's move. So we're on this side. He's taking all the damage on this side. We got to hammer him again. Hit him hard, please, as much as you can. Okay, we're penetrating. Solid connection on that one, Commander. Come on. Got it. Yes, two more hits. Don't care, make his ass unstable. HE firing. Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh my god, that was awesome. Mission successful. You know, if we had a couple ton tons more each of ATM ammo, we could have just stayed back and fired, but <sighs> we had to move in. Man, four kills for Gaucho. Good job, girl. Well, 
significant damage, but I don't think there's anything we, don't, we can't really replace. I mean, there was the weapon mount that we lost. Nova CWS. I think we've got a backup. Patchwork materials, I think, are the biggest things here. Um, ATM-12 we can replace, I think. The ammo we can't, though. Well, this is going to be an interesting rebuild. We're going to have to jump around and find some ammo. Uh, grasshopper part. Do we take it? We only get two parts. So we can't complete a mech. We should look for something that's going to give us sea bills or we can replace that we've lost. So weapon mount first. They're closer to the bottom, I think. Patchwork materials they've got there. Okay. So I think we take these guys. At least we're replacing some of the stuff we lost. Yeah. Alright, catapult part, strix part, trebuchet, wolf found part. Yeah, not much. Okay. Ah, we got another catapult. Hooray for that. And a lot of repair bill. Wow, that's a... Uh, well, at least we're selling the catapult for that. Let's see what's on it, though, before we get rid of it. Just can't afford to keep uh, any more mechs. Let's see what we got. Be nice if it's got a few components that we can use, but it's unlikely. It is a catapult after all. It's got the core, so we can sell that. MML9, eh. Yeah, nothing really. How much does it sell for? Oh, well, that covers the repair costs anyway. Not the component losses, but the repair costs. All right, guys, didn't they're not going to get a chance to get to that third mission today. I mean, it was only a two and a half skull anyway, so not a big deal. It was it two and a half or one and a half? The small two skull. Um, so yeah, we won't get a chance to get to that one today. Actually, you know what? Screw it. Let's just do it real quick. It's a destroy base. We're going to go a full rep with Clan Ghost Bear because how much? What's our rep with these guys? Doesn't say. It should say though. Oh, here it is here. Yeah, we're almost at liked. Current faction rep is 15. So that should get us to liked. So even if we don't... Even if we just cover our drop costs... Let's do it this way. We're still going to get... We're still going to become liked by Ghost Bear. Either way, let's accept this. And it's a destroy base, right? So... Um, you know what? Eagle and Giant. Let's go with the Orion. And the Mjolnir. I think these two should be able to handle it. Two, two skull mission. All right, here we go. Let's do this fast and get out of here. I bet the bugs here are the size of your head. Well, at least the size of your hand. Double time. Let's go. Hey. Hey. Okay, what do we got? Phoenix Hawk. What do we got? One turret here. Light turret chassis. Let's uh, take it out. And yeah, we were tagging the uh, their dropship. Let them know we see them. We actually just we. <laughs> We blinded the pilot with a laser pointer, so he crashed the dropship. Say goodbye, Clint. Standing by. You sure ain't no Clint Eastwood. Wind it up. Because that's what these racks are for. And here it goes. Critical hit. 
destroyed. It did say engine destroyed, but I guess not. Thanks for showing up. <laughs> Twelve left in the center. You seriously gonna move in after that, are you? Club, no. Um. It's got 180, eh? See ya. I love how the birds all fly out of the trees. It's awesome. All the little details, so nice. What's up, boss? Moving out. You only got 120, eh? There you go. All you had to do was hit the CT. Well, you stripped the armor away. Yeah, Commander. Come on, ladies. Let's finish this up. We have important work to do back on the ship. You and you. You get a rotary and you get a medium ER. Nicely done. That turret is gone. Two mechs left. Hey. There. Okay. okay. And firing. All three of them hit. Nicely done. I did. Well, I didn't really, but I'm saying I did because I'm trying to bolster your your confidence here. There's only two of you. You're gonna make him pay for that, right? Make him pay. <laughs> it's go time. Finish him up for me, please. Don't need to go full racks on this. Don't want to jam. I know we're getting full salvage out of this, and I should probably be more careful, but just want to make sure we don't lose any components in the process, which is why I'm being completely brutal here. Ooh, missed with everything. We'll sift through the wreckage once we're done here. Shred him. Here it comes. That's a kill. Yeah, it's a kill. All right. Hey. Let's get these buildings. See if they got reinforcements. Oh Unlikely. Unlikely, but you never know. This guy. Enemy structure, enemy structure eliminated. 
And we'll get the racks on two more, and we're done. Here it comes. One down. And the last one. Alright, let's go home. Well, at least Ghost Bear Nut likes us now, so we should get a little bit better missions from them. Nice. Well, you got all three mechs, eh? I guess with the racks, you can't not get all the mechs. How much is this worth? Yeah, I'll take that, because we'll sell it. Fire control system energy. These are nice. Increased crit chance. Wow, there's like nothing here. Uh, worth 500000 each. Sure. And then what? Tag? We got four of them. We don't need it. ER medium. <sighs> Phoenix lock part, I guess. Yeah, we got everything except for a couple of other, a couple of minor things. All right, not bad. All right, very, very minimum damages, which is awesome. So we should get those mechs back relatively quick. So I'll manage the tasks and everything, get everything sorted. What we're going to do is we're going to jump systems. There is a flashpoint relatively close by. It's got 94 days to go, and it's a long, hard uh, tier 5 flashpoint, or level 5 flashpoint. Uh, it's 4 Comstar, but I don't really care. Sorry, 74 days to go. It's already 13 days away. So um, what we'll do is we'll get our mechs back, get everything ready to go, and I think we'll take that one. Uh, the planet is two skull planet so we'll probably jump you know get really close by here's a four skull asgard planet we can probably jump over there 11 days um and we'll pull off a bunch more missions uh try not to get any mechs out of service we'll get our bigger bigger boys back um the, the catapult the kerberos and stuff so these guys are going to take still a little while to get back into battle um so we'll get our other mechs into play i think before that um Let's do, what do we want to do here? Who do we want back? That's the question. The dire wolf, I think, should come back. I'll have to plan it out. I'll figure out what we're going to do. Because some of the mechs are going to require some repairs after they come back. So, not sure what we're going to do in that regard. And we still need to get the king crab fixed up. Uh, it's lost a bunch of stuff. we got to get that fixed. So, um, it's nice to be uh, at least liked by Clan Ghost Bear now. Um, keep getting this vacuum, faction reputation up as high as we can to get some good missions from them against Comstar, see what we can do. Maybe, if you know, depending on how long the series goes, depending on how long it takes to get, get the new version of Rogue Tech out, we might even ally, ally with them against Comstar, but we'll see how it goes. All right, but until then, I'm going to leave the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.